It could be the biggest auction in Sotheby's history. Paintings from Rothko, Modigliani, and Picasso. And these are just a few of the highlights. They are all part of the collection of billionaire real estate developer and former Sotheby's owner, A. Alfred Taubman, who passed away earlier this year. His collection features 500 pieces that could fetch over a half a billion dollars. The contemporary art that Mr. Taubman collected is exceptional. It's highlighted by two amazing Rothko paintings, one from 1952, which is a dominant year, and one from 1962, which is a late dominant year. Both of them are estimated at 20 to 30 million dollars and expected to sell in this range. As for who's scooping up the paintings with eight-figure price tags, well, it all comes back to one thing. Everyone who has the money can be a buyer. But it's not just paintings from the world's most famous artists. The Taubman collection includes a host of statues and sculptures. He collected lots of wonderful sculpture from Jean Art to uh, Giacometti. So the variety, the scope of his collecting went two-dimensional, three-dimensional, went in every direction. Taubman is famous for founding Taubman Centers, a publicly traded real estate investment trust that develops shopping malls. There's 2,000 years of art history here, and he was very much a self-made man and a self-made collector. He chose what he liked and looked at all different types of art from around the world. The collection is so vast, the auction will be held in phases over the next six months, starting November 4th. Now, Sotheby's expects sales from the Taubman collection to eclipse the 2009 Christie's auction from East St. Laurent, which brought in $477 million in sales. At Sotheby's in New York, I'm Scott Gam for The Street. Thank you.